Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss about the installation procedure of the Oracle Linux operating system on Vagrant. Let us start the discussion by showing the waterfall model which comprises of multiple milestones and each milestone has an objective to accomplish. The primary milestone starts with spinning up the box with Oracle Linux OS and proceeds with the milestones installing Java, Database 12C, WebLogic, creation of SO domain and deployment of the project in domain. Now let us see step by step procedure. First of all, the authorized user logins to the Jenkins portal by giving the required credentials and click on the Vagrant pipeline which is present at the top of the page which in return takes to the page where we can see all the pipelines over there. Click on the run button on first pipeline which presents at the topmost center of the page which results in change of color from blue to yellow color which indicates that the job has been initiated. Click on the console button which presents at the bottom most right part of the pipeline which leads to spinning up of Linux OS. Once the task is finished, a new page pops up regarding its console output where we can see the message that Red Hat Linux is installed successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button which presents at the bottom most right part of the second dashboard which results in change of color from blue to yellow color which indicates that the job has been initiated. Click on the console button which presents at the bottom most right part of the pipeline which leads to the installation of Java once the task is finished. A new page pops up regarding its console output where we can see the message that Java runtime environment installed successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button which presents at the bottom most right part of the third dashboard which results in change of color from blue to yellow color which indicates that the job has been initiated. Click on the console button which presents at the bottom most right part of the pipeline which leads to the installation of Oracle Database 12C. Once the task is finished, a new page pops up regarding its console output where we can see the message that Oracle Database 12C installed successfully, and we can also observe the path where it directories are stored in that particular machine. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button of the fourth dashboard which in return changes the color from blue to yellow. Further, click on the console button on the dashboard and a page gets pop up with console output. Here we can see that the web logic has been installed successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button of the fifth dashboard which in return changes the color from blue to yellow. Further. Click on the console button on that dashboard and a page gets pop up with console output. Here we can see that the SO has been installed successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button of the sixth dashboard which in return changes the color from blue to yellow. Further, click on the console button on the dashboard and a page gets pop up with console output. Here we can see that the SO domain will be created successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button which presents at the bottom most right part of the seventh dashboard which results in change of color from blue to yellow color which indicates that the job has been initiated. Click on the console button which presents at the bottom most right part of the pipeline which leads to the startup of SO domain once the task is finished. A new page pops up regarding its console output where we can see the message that SO domain has started successfully. We can also see the ERLS regarding the web logic. Later click on the URL regarding the web logic and enter into it by giving the required credentials and you can observe that the admin server is running successfully. Now go back to the Vagrant pipeline and click on the trigger button which presents at the bottom most right part of the 8th dashboard which results in change of color from blue to yellow color which indicates that the job has been initiated. Click on the console button which presents at the bottom most right part of the pipeline which leads to the deployment of calculator once the task is finished. A new page pops up regarding its console output where we can see the message that all of the test cases of calculator program deployed successfully. Thank you for watching this video. For any questions please reach us devops at eaidsb.com.